What's up guys? Welcome to another video. I'm Lori if you're new here. So we're trying something I haven't tried before. So it's actually called Bee Free Honey. Here it is. So as you know, honey comes from bees and that's not really a vegan thing. Um, I know it's kind of a gray area for some vegans. Some vegans still eat it. Some vegans don't. Any recipes that come up with or like in my coffee or tea or whatever, I switched to maple syrup because we have here in Canada, we have abundance of maple syrup here and I love me some dark maple syrup. So anyways, my friend Ashley, actually Ashley Nicole Rice, who's another vegan YouTuber in the States, we did a vegan snack swap exchange. So she sent me a bunch of American goodies and I sent her a bunch of Canadian goodies and this was in the box that she sent me. So I have not actually tried vegan honey. We actually do sell some, I'm not sure if it's this brand, but we do have brands in Canada I have seen. I just haven't tried any, so I've been waiting for the opportunity. So I'm actually gonna try it uh, solo, I guess like on a spoon, I wanna see the taste, but then I also have um, just some hot water here because I'm gonna make a moringa tea. I got this in one of my vegan cuts box, uh, which is delicious by the way. It's moringa organic superfood tea with blueberry. It's one of my favorite teas. And I have so much teas, I'm trying to really get into tea more. Um, but maybe with this new honey, maybe I have a new opportunity to do that. Normally I just drink it uh, plain unless I go out to, like if we do a Tim Hortons drive-thru or something, I might get a tea um, and I'll get them to put sugar. Okay, so guess what this is made out of? You're never gonna guess, unless you've had honey before and you've researched it. It's made out of apples. What? So it's made out of apple juice, lemon juice, and water, and that's it. Like seriously, that's crazy. It says this one jar of honey helps uh, 7,500 bees. So I guess instead of um, us taking the honey from the bees, and so I know some people call uh, honey bee vomit, because <laughs> technically that's what it is. Ah, I can't open it. Oh my God, it is exactly the consistency of it. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys the consistency. This is exactly like honey. Look at how thick that is. <laughs> Like this is, this looks so similar. Oh my God. This is pretty insane. Like, you know, I just did another video on um, vegan tuna. Like it just blows my mind how like anything that you want, you can find a plant-based option. Like somebody has created it, someone has thought of it. <laughs> and if they didn't yet, it's gonna happen. So, so crazy. Okay, so I'm just gonna get a little bit. I don't wanna have a whole mouthful. <laughs> I'm just gonna try a little bit in a little teaspoon here. Hmm. Okay, definitely tastes, it's the consistency of honey, 100% the same consistency. It does have like, um, what's the word, like a tart apple taste, slightly. Um, it is like a fruity honey, and that's actually how I would describe it. So a normal honey is very just, it's very sweet, but it's not fruity sweet. It's just like a sweet honey, right? <laughs> just, I don't know how to else to describe it. This is very, it's like a fruitiness. It's got like a, like I said, a tartness or something of like, um, maybe if I didn't know it was apples, that's the other thing. If I had tasted it without knowing it's apples, I think I would still think it's some kind of tartness to it. I wouldn't quite know what it's like maybe lemon or you know maybe I don't know maybe I wouldn't know what's in it or what it's made out of but oh my god this is so good so I'm gonna put a little bit in my tea now I've already licked the spoon so I'm just gonna pour, pour a little bit I don't want to double dip the spoon in here oh my god it's so thick so you can see it's right on the bottom just like a normal honey and it's dissolving in water which is what you want out of a honey So I'm just gonna taste it and see. I don't know, it's still gonna have the sweetness to it, but I just didn't wanna try it, try it just on a spoon. I kinda wanted to put it in something that I would normally put honey, right? I can't really taste it because I just had like basically about a half of a tablespoon of that honey straight, so it was so sweet. So now when I put it in there, I don't actually taste the fruitiness, but it is um, it is blueberry tea that I put it in, so. Um, blueberries aren't super super sweet compared to apples I guess but um, I don't know this is like crazy I'm like super impressed I cannot believe all these vegan things I try and I'm, I don't really have huge expectations um, 
because some things are like you know what's the word like sometimes you find you try a vegan thing like vegan cheese is a perfect example it's not the same as a regular cheese but if you can have regular cheese or you decide not to have you know be part of that cruelty for the you know the dairy industry and you want to have a vegan cheese it's better than not having cheese so like some che obviously there's crappy cheeses there's great cheeses but like if you can get your hands on good cheeses it's like pretty close to the good thing to the to the original thing i guess we'll say obviously it's cruelty free and there's no cholesterol um but it's like good enough you know and i say a lot of a lot of times even with my vegan jerky uh, video that i did it's not the same as jerky but you know what it's good enough like it's it doesn't have to be exactly like the original because there's no cruelty no cholesterol you know it's helping the planet you're helping your heart you're healthy you're helping the animals obviously so it's like it's good enough but i'm telling you guys this is like i don't know i think i like this better than the honey because it's got that little tartness to it that lemony tartness like oh it's so good <laughs> Um, now I'm trying to think about all the recipes. I've always swapped it in my head, like to use maple syrup. Now I've got to go back and find recipes I can actually use honey for. So excited! So anyways, hopefully you do try this. So please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you like my channel. And until next time, live your life with kindness for all living beings. Take care. Bye!